Hi friends, today we are going to deploy EC2 service which is Elastic Computing Cloud for Amazon. You can find it recent visited because I am recently working with that or you can go to service under compute you will find EC2 service. Just click on EC2 that will load the EC2 dashboard where you can get that information which is how many machines are deployed and how many snapshot is there or elastic IP you are using. For launching the instance we have to create click on launch instance as uh, it will load the steps and uh, from AWS marketplace we will choose CentOS and uh, we will going to use that CentOS x86-64 which is also a free tier eligible select it and uh, there is the pricing list showing all the pricing details click continue we will select the default which is also uh, free tier eligible which is T2 micro we will click on next this is the default settings for this default VPC which is created with that profile and we will not, not touch nothing we will do no changes we will not and we will go to next which is add storage we will keep it default we will only click on delete on termination when that is EC2 instance will deleted that disk will be deleted by default and next in the tag session we will add the tag tag as name as our EC2 instance name let's take test and configure security group will only allow port 22 to the everyone and click on launch instance this is the reminder that uh, your boot is SSD is free in your eligible for free tier eligibility you can use free tier also and this is the default this is the configuration and click launch that will prompt you for the key which is required for login to the SSH we will choose a new key pair name it as a test download the key it will download the PEM file and remind that the AWS not stored any key so you have to download you are not getting second chance to download the key again so if you if you forgot to keep that key you have to delete the instance and create it from scratch then click on launch is launching this will take some time
and says running and is initializing I will pause the video for a while we will be back when it's deployed now our EC2 instance is ready it's time to connect let's copy the EC2 server name and CentOS is the default user go to SSH authentication test the PPK and open accept it and it is working folder this end was is created and congratulations you have successfully created a EC2 instance on AWS console thank you